three run advantage. 6 3 our score after eight. First pitch swinging, a high pop fly off the bat of Alexander Palma. And that becomes a souvenir. Nice grab by a gentleman in a gray t shirt. Really fun game here today. Got underway, 1 o'clock local time. Coming up on 4.45 local time now. Venezuela got off to a fast start. Three runs in the top of the first. They have not trailed, though Cuba did pull within one. It was 4-3 after five. And then Perez with a home run in the sixth inning to extend the lead, an insurance run in the eighth. And now we're into the ninth, and a new pitcher should have mentioned, Rydell Martinez, 24-year-old. Nice pitch inside, tied up Palma, who's had a two for four day so far. He's popped out to the catcher, struck out swinging, and twice singled. Really complete performance from the Venezuelan club today. And a foul back here. It's going to hang at one and two. Venezuela trying to do something they haven't done in nearly 70 years, and that's beat Cuba in what's termed a major international competition. It's a World Cup, an Olympic qualifier, something of that nature, something at that level. Last time they did it, the 1953 Baseball World Cup. And here's a leadoff single for Palma, who has a three-hit day. Contributions up and down the lineup from Venezuela. It plays that really make you just scratch your head and say, how did he do that? Meanwhile, at the plate, a little bit of a different story. He's gone 0 for 4 with four strikeouts. He shows bunt and snaps his head back out of the way. That was right under his chin. Oh, boy. Hard fastball from Martinez. Now a fastball over the plate, and no bunt from Castro that time. He was swinging for the fences, fouled it straight back, one and one, and I don't really blame him. Taking a big, healthy cut. Arube Barruena, the shortstop, and Mujica, the second baseman, pinched together. Cuba'd love a ground ball, double play. But instead it's a bunt, back to the pitcher. And it could be a double play, but nobody at first, they get there in time. It wasn't pretty, but it'll go down 1-6-4. Yadil Mujica scrambling. And Ramon Flores trying to keep the inning alive, looks at ball one low. Martinez again on the younger side of this Cuban roster. Certainly a transitional period for Cuba. You've got guys 40 plus and a couple of pitchers in their early 20s. And a bounding ball to first base goes foul. The starting pitcher, Lazaro Blanco, 35 years old. But then you had the 22 year old Chi, the 22 year old Rodriguez, 25 year old Levan Moinello, 24 year old Rydell Martinez. So the youth in the bullpen the experience on the bench, in the field, in the starting lineup. A lot of hitters in the mid to upper 30s. One one pitch. In the air to left field, Cepeda. No, that would be Santos at this point. Makes the catch, side retired. No runs, one hit, nobody left. Here we go, bottom of the ninth inning. Cuba trails 6-3, to three. Venezuela on the verge of a big, big victory. 